I've ever had. Uh, even the grass didn't grow, and it's the strangest thing I've ever Hi, seen. Hi, my name is Mike McCoy, WD4AM, in Illinois, uh, North Carolina. And we recently just set just up a two meter all, FM station here, here myself, but, uh, in the anyway, kitchen, and, and we bought a Yezu uh, FT2500M, as in Mike, FM in transceiver. And this is the Mount Mitchell repeater net going on here on Saturday night. Mount Mitchell repeater is the highest repeater from here to eastern to the Mississippi. Good coverage of 600 miles. And it is powered by Astron 20 amp power supply. And it's had 31 programmable memories. And I recently found this little unit at the pawn shop and basically got it for $10. Done a little repair work on the microphone and is built military specs. It's an older type transceiver, but still rugged and still good and very accessible for hams. As you can see, it has a it has a weather band if you want more weather service. And also on the microphone area here, you can select up and down the frequencies. So here's just another some of the things you can pick up. Amateur radio is not all that expensive if you just know where to find it. And if you have a little technical experience and repairs, you can always you can always uh, repair your rigs. So seven threes from Lenore, North Carolina, on one four five one nine zero. And thanks to Randy and all the folks that keep the repeaters up. And we need more activity on two meters. We need to keep it alive. If we don't, there's a good chance we can lose it. Once again, seven threes. This is. WD4AM from Lenore, North Carolina.